welcome to Total Seed. We're a family-owned seed company working through the best seeds in the world, and this is how we do it. This week, we're wrapping up our tour of all the processes it takes to get our corn from the field to the bag and ready to send to our customers. So just to recap, our corn has been harvested, taken to our facility, put in a green sort, gotten a quick sort for size, sent out of green sort and up to the dryer, then placed in the dryer bins. We've taken a look at how our dryer works and the air pressure chamber it creates. Then our corn's been taken out of the dryer and sent around the building. It's been put into the shallow where it's tumbled around on itself to get the kernels off the cob. And it's been through its first clean and sent to a trip scale. Then our president, Aaron Conaway, took over the tour of our seed tower. And so far, he's shown you how we size and sort our corn. Then the treatment process. And now this week, he's going to take you through the final step, which is our bagging process. So just to get an overview real quick, those bins that we are seeing up, up there, are the, in the bins way up in the corner, are the bins that the treaters were sitting on, to, on top of. So we had two treaters. Over there was the um, GLCPS treater that we were looking at most of the time. And when it treats, it dumps right into those bins that goes right into our packaging equipment. Check the look out over here. Here starts the packaging process. We have the scale that sits above um, our packaging equipment. And from here, we have two choices. We can either package in uh, paper bags or can package in seed boxes or bulk bags. And what we do is we have this trolley that, um, that floats back and forth. So if we want uh, corn to go into a box or a bulk bag, we drop it in onto this conveyor and then it drops it into, that, uh, into a box or a bulk bag. If we want to put it in paper bags, we slide um, the conveyor over on a trolley and then at that point, the corn can go through the scale and drop into the paper bags. We load our paper bags into here. It automatically picks up the paper bag um, and hangs it and fills the, fills the bag on a predetermined weight. It drops it, it continues to hold the top of the bag until it, as it takes it from station to station. This is an automatic tag placer. We have uh, the ability to put two different tags on at one time, so it automatically applies the tag as it's headed to the sewing machine. It gets sewed, printed, and gets kicked off. What happens is when it gets kicked off, we're able to adjust this conveyor here in order to move the seed in the, in the bag um, either direction that we need to in order, in order for it to be really flat and really full across from the, the top to the bottom in order for it to stack well. And then we have um, this conveyor that's square tubing. Square tubing uh, really beats the bag just gently enough to vibrate the, uh, the seed across the entire bag and it also helps flatten it out. From the hair, it goes around a curved conveyor into a robot. So for our robot here, we, um, um, here, our robot station is here. Our bagging scale and our bagging uh, controls are all right here. The other thing I wanted to mention is that we have everything interlocked at this stage of the game. Um, once the corn is treated, that we can't open uh, more than one bin at a time. So if we're ready to open up a bin, uh, one bin can be opened at a time. Um, this is where we have a touch screen that we can control that. We can hit the um, vibrators and all of our bins in order to shake all the seed loose to make sure that we keep variety purity. And so that's where this touch screen comes into play. corn comes around, gets fed into our robot. We usually have pallets stacked in here. A lot of times we can have uh, three pallets at a time, just empty pallets stacked here on top of each other. The robot has two little suction cups on the end of it, so it swings and pulls the cardboard from the pile of cardboard and applies it to the, uh, the pallet before it starts stacking. Once the cardboard's there, it starts stacking. Once it's done stacking, the robot comes in on the floor truck, breaks the light curtain, picks the, uh, picks the pallet up, and pulls it over there to, to stack it, um, uh, to, to, to wrap the finished pallet. The other thing I wanted to mention, um, which is uh, really important, we have camera stations uh, all over. Uh, we have these stations of cameras 
cameras stationed all over our tower to where we can see inside of uh, all of our bins, uh, all of our equipment. We can see inside our hoppers uh, of, in our, uh, of our scales um, for two things. One, to see what's going on, and two, this really also helps to make sure that uh, we have things kernel cleaned as we switch from grade side to grade size and from uh, hybrid to hybrid. So cameras have been a huge important part of our operation over the last five years and we continue to find new places to put cameras, it seems like almost every day. From here, like I mentioned, it goes over here to this wrapper. Our pallets get put on this wrapper. We don't have an automated wrapper. We like to hand uh, wrap all of our pallets. That way we can pull down every flap as we wrap it to ensure that the pallet is nice and square and you can read every bag of them. From here, uh, from the wrapper, the fork truck takes it, takes it to the warehouse, and that's the end of the line for this tour. And that's how we get our final corn seed. I hope you enjoyed this tour and learned a little bit about how our corn seed's made. Next week, we're gonna be in a tour of what it takes to get our soybeans through the same process of going from the field to being ready to send to our customers. But for now, check out some great photos from this week. We say it a lot, but our team worked very hard to make sure that we are growing the best seeds in the world. And we thank them for all that hard work and the hours and effort they put in. And we thank you. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like and subscribe to our channel. If you want more content from Total Seed, you can follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and LinkedIn. Don't worry, I'll leave all that down below. Thank you again for watching, and we hope you enjoyed another look at the Total Picture.